Counseling, you know, you, you monitor the cases very closely. But then in the end, when they go back to their families, Families, we w used to work with the families, but that monitoring with the families was not as close as the monitoring with the girl. So the thing is, these girls used to go back to the families, and then again, there used to be these problems, you know. So the families were not very good role models, so they ended up uh, not, not like going back to doing certain things which they shouldn't, you know, something. Sort of Welfare homes used to have quite a high proportion of Indian cases, you know, uh, among the boys, among the girls also. Uh, I mean, in proportion to the population of uh, the Indian population, you know. So there used to be Malay and Indian cases used to be quite a high element, you know, in these homes. Uh, basically, I think these are the homes where uh, the father. Is a non is an alcoholic. Father is uh, probably he's been an ill-treated child himself, and as he grew older, he himself. Battered children are supposed to be batterers, you know. Children who are battered, eventually they say that quite a number of them end up as batterers themselves. So uh, we should have we should, used to have a n number of these. Uh, boys and girls who used to be involved in drugs, you know, uh, or the girls used to be involved with, e easily they used to have boyfriends, no problem at all having boyfriends, you know. So uh, the boys used to be peer groups, you know, being involved with uh, undesirable peer groups, uh, drug offenders and so on or gangsters, so uh, very easily they used to get drawn into these activities, you know, and they used to end up, a lot of cases used to end up with a probation department. And some of the cases under probation used to end up in the homes, you know, the, the hostels or the welfare homes. So that's where we used to come in, the rehabilitation, the aftercare. So I used to have uh, some officers who used to be known as aftercare officers and their job was to be the intermediary between the families and the children in the homes. You know?